Hello people, uh, I just wanted to make an update video for those of you who follow me and are wondering what in the heck is going on with this girl, where is she, what happened, yada yada yada. Okay, so basically I am back in Connecticut and I found a studio in Connecticut that is you like you don't need a lease it's a month to month and um yeah and i got a little part-time job and i'm basically just living my life working saving money and just keeping to myself it is still my dream to go back to los angeles yes it is it's my dream to have a career that i like a full-time job and a place in LA um, and right now I'm saving up to get another car because if you follow me you know that my car was impounded in LA yikes and um, so I'm saving to get another car and after that I'm saving so that I can eventually go back to LA. Now I'm only 28 years old. I'll be 29 this year. It's crazy. Like I'm getting old. I hate it. I hate that I'll be 29 this year. But um, yeah. So basically, yeah. I am. It'll. I was gonna say that it could take years for me to finally get what I want in life, but I'm only 29. I have my entire 30s. I have no idea what's gonna happen in my 30s in my life. So yeah, basically anything could happen in my 30s. I have my whole entire 30s to figure out what I wanna do, how I wanna establish my life, and then there's the 40s, and then the 50s, and the 60s, and. Who knows, I could meet a partner. I've been on a few dates and stuff. I'm, I'm always dating. I'm always, 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 always dating. Um, I've been on like maybe like four or five dates since I've been back to Connecticut. Um, I don't settle. I'm very picky. I'm not that picky, but I don't settle. And I just go out a lot. Well, not a lot. I'm a homebody, but um, yeah, anyway. Just to let you know, I'm doing better. I'm doing much better. And it's just, I want to be able to have a career that I actually love. Like, I'm looking into internships. And um, I'm looking into internships. And I'm trying to see if I can find one that I actually like and a job that I actually like before I make the commitment a full time because right now um, I'm collecting a check and along with a part time job and before I like I need to make sure that I get the job that I actually really am passionate about before I let that go. But anyway, what else? Um, yeah life is hard there are some things like i need to take responsibility for that transpired with me from between la and now being in connecticut it was horrible i was homeless i had nowhere to go it was like upsetting but um I feel like the way a lot of things were handled were very unkind. Not not by everyone, by some people. Some people in my journey from LA to settling in Connecticut now were just very unkind, very nasty, very rude, unnecessarily. Now nobody's perfect, everybody played as a part in, you know, and take responsibility for themselves. But yeah, anyway, I keep to myself and I just stick and talk to the people who uplift me and who are positive and can see that I was going through something then 
And instead of trying to humiliate me and bring me down, um, uplift me and give me encouraging words and give me space and give me time and realize that it took it took time. It took time for me to get back on my feet. But anyway, um, leave a message. I, I thank you for checking in on me. And yeah, leave a message. And yeah, I see them in the comments. But all right, um, let's talk to you later. Bye.